gamers are are I don't know if it's um Xbox gamers or if it's just gamers in general. I think it might just be all gamers in general. Maybe it's it's like the new wave of, of the generation, you know, the ones that that had uh, just got who started gaming in the PS3 360 era and now they're growing up. Now they're, you know, they're young teenagers or in their mid teens or late teens and it's it's those are the kids that are that are doing dumb shit like this. It's my day off today, guys. All right. And I woke up at nine o'clock in the morning, and I went on my YouTube Twitter or YouTube uh, sub feed to see what was going on, you know, checking out some new videos. I saw one by Digital Foundry, so I was like, okay, it's about Ark. Again, I'm not too interested in, but it was the Xbox One version, so I was thinking, all right, well, you know, I know how this game goes on PC. Like, I've, I've played this game for a few hours on PC, and, and I know what it's like. <laughs> I know the struggle of trying to run this fucking game. So I was like, I was thinking, okay, let me let me just go check out what this uh, what the Xbox One version is looking like. And it's it's trash. It's trash. It's like it it runs at below twenty FPS. Like look look at this shit. Twenty three frames, twenty four frames per second. Like this this is trash, guys. This this isn't even like oh like nine frames per second, dude. This isn't even like it's so low that you know it's annoying. It's 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 so low that it's unplayable. It's unenjoyable. I don't know how you, how you play a game like this and have a good time. Sixteen frames, thirteen frames per second, and and. If you watch the whole video, they, they talk about how, or they they, they have like uh, the resolution scale on it, and it was below 720. I think it was like 648p or something like that. That that's 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 below H an HD picture quality. Their screen tearing. I haven't seen a screen. I haven't seen screen tearing in a video game since the PS3 and 360. That that it's been a long time since I've seen screen tearing like this in a video game. But that that that's not even the part that I'm I'm, I'm upset about. Like, I understand this is a hard game to run. Like it's a huge, very ambitious game. And stuff like that so I'm not even upset about about um, the way it runs on, on the Xbox one because I'm not surprised like it, any, any PC gamer can tell you that this game was not gonna run well the second they hit this console early access or full release this shit was not going to be running smoothly because it's just not a game that it's gonna run smoothly on, on a console like this like if, if you have to have a fucking Titan or a GTX 980 Ti just to fucking run this game at a decent frame like that there's, there's no way that the Xbox one was gonna be able to run this game at any decent frames or or a decent image quality for that matter so no one is really surprised about that given the console specs but the part that, that pisses me off this they said that this sold a million already a million people bought this yeah, I mean, they managed to sell one million copies of uh, Ark on Xbox One, so... Yeah, it's not even finished yet either, so there's a lot of development time to go, so hopefully they can... They sold a million copies of a game like this on the Xbox One. Does that even fucking make sense? I, I, I'm kind of upset that, like, in a day where... I, I never fucking thought that I would live in a day of gaming to where a game like Ark Survival, that runs at below 20 FPS, at, below, at sub-720 uh, resolution, with screen tearing on an an eighth gen console, I never thought I would see the day that this game would sell more units than a game like Bayonetta 2 on the Wii. That's stupid. That's that's retarded. I'm sorry. And so like I thought at first that this was like an early access, like oh you like sign up for something and, and then you get to play the beta for free or something on Xbox One. Like if that was the case, I'd be like fine, whatever. It's a shit. The, the game is running like shit. But you know what? Whatever. You don't have to pay. If if it's free. Whatever, you can't complain about something that's free, right? But people paid money for this shit. See, th this is why this game is going to be in beta for the sh longest fucking time. Like, th the reason why I feel like th this game is gonna has been in beta for so long and is going to be in beta for so long is because two things. One, yeah, it's a really big game. It's really ambitious. There's a lot of stuff going on. I mean, it's not better than Xenoblade, but it's, pretty, it's a pretty big game. And then two, it's because people keep throwing money at these developers. Like, if these developers are getting millions and millions of dollars from, from you guys, for an unfinished product, they don't really have that much incentive to rush the game or, or, or to finish the game in a timely fashion. This game will, can be a beta for the next three years and people would still be buying it and no one would be saying a damn thing. No one would be complaining because it's whatever, it's not finished. And, and the, the, that's, the, that's the mindset that they put you in. They want you to buy their game but have the, in the back of your mind saying, oh, it'll it'll be finished eventually. It'll be optimized eventually. It, you'll be able, it'll be playable soon enough. Just just keep buying it. You keep playing it. Keep sinking hundreds and hundreds of hours in, into this game because it'll sooner or later it'll be playable. Like that, that's not how game development should work. Like if they're gonna put out a, a beta, it needs to be a free beta. 
Like, I understand they need to make money. I understand they need to be able to put food on the table, but they also need to be able to finish a game in a timely fashion. Like, this game shouldn't be in beta for two, three years. Like, that doesn't make sense to me. Like, Overwatch, they, they had, like, what? Like, a six-month beta? Six, seven-month beta period before they're planning on releasing the game? That's a, that's a good beta amount. That, that's a good amount of time to be having a beta, to be fixing problems and fixing glitches and bugs that, that are found in the community so that they can release the game fully and have a complete working game having a, a game in beta for two three years and charging people just to play it that's not a that's not a beta that, that's just paying for an unfinished product at, at this point like that's what i feel like i don't know I, I didn't like this game very much i played a couple hours and i, I was never really interested in it I, I, obviously a lot of people because the thing is about xbox gamers though like they, these console gamers they don't they don't know what <laughs> they don't know about this stuff like this was a pc because i guarantee you that most people that bought this thing on xbox probably never fucking heard about this game until it was announced for xbox one they're like what, what the fuck is arc i never heard of this game before looks cool oh the pc exclusive all right looks cool i'll buy it. so they don't know they don't know how, they didn't they, they probably never knew how hard this game this game was to run on a beast of a rigged pc to begin with so they probably had no idea that this game was going to run like shit on the xbox one so maybe maybe, maybe that's their just ignorance or no but usually when you know you're interested in the game you kind of look up stuff about it right i'm sure there were plenty of videos about people talking about the, the frame rates or, or the low image quality or how the fact that the thing isn't even fucking playable to begin with so i'm sure if you looked that shit up you would have been able to see that but most of them probably didn't obviously they went out and then and they they <laughs> they gave they they paid their money for this early access title and and, and now they they they're playing at 20 fps at a sub at a sub at below 720p resolution with screen tearing we're gonna be getting more and more of this bullshit, dude. Like, it's it's real stupid, but it's whatever. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new and whatnot. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.